Why sea otters are the biggest psychopaths of the ocean. These fuzzy little fellas will literally kidnap otter babies and hold them underwater until the mother gives up her food. They're also extremely violent when it comes to the hormone deed. Not only will they take advantage of seal pups to the point of unsubscribing them from life, which can actually take up to seven days. Just imagine how traumatic this is for the seal pup, and it does not stop there. They will also continue to try and mate with the seal's body, even after the fact. In addition to this, around 4% of female sea otter deaths come from wounds during hormone activities. They have even been observed trying to mate with deceased birds and flipping dogs. Now, I know we shouldn't enforce human values on them, like calling them evil and nasty creatures, but it feels very wrong calling them cute and cuddly after acquiring this knowledge. Now, this is not really that surprising, considering that these furry guys are also related to creatures like the honey badger and wolverine, which we all know to be the biggest menaces there is.